Welcome back to Y Caliber, folks. I'm your guide, Matt, and we're continuing the Citadel DLC for Mass Effect 3. It's the final DLC, and we've already done pretty much everything. With the production of Francis Kidd's All L4 Hamlet coming to a close, I am now available. Well, that's good to know. If you know any good agents, please send them my way. If I run into a good agent, I'll let them know. I haven't yet, though. So let's see here. We were looking at meeting up with Zaid and Trainer, and they're on the Castle Arcade. So upstairs somewhere, I guess. And it says Castle Arcade. Okay, so we're on the right track. I'm on the hunt. I'm after you. You look suspicious. Welcome Just standing there. Thanks. Yeah, who's here? Don't know any of you. Just Rock'em Sock'em Robots? Shattered Iza- oh, I see what you did there. Price to play. Punch your opponent to lower their health meter and earn points. Survive as many points as possible learning points. Blocking heavy jabs. Drop a punch to break through blocks. Jab interrupt when they're charging up. Punch. Block. Okay. Let's give it a shot. It shattered Ezo. Oh man. I'm gonna punch you so hard. Jerk. Don't stop now. I'm not going to stop now. You can do better than I that. see you. I see what you're doing. Oh, you jerk. Nice punch. I got you. What, how are you still alive? Come on, down you go. You're doing great. Yeah, we got him. That was terrible. Nice punch. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No, 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 we're in a loop. Oh, 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 oh. Oh no, my head! My head! Oh, I lost. I can't, and I can't imagine how. I did terribly. Anyway, upstairs, I think we've got some individuals. We're not big on fighting games. Alright, Taylor. T Taylor? Trainer? Trainer. Trainer's the one that I'm wanting to meet here. There we go. You're hidden over there. Are you on a date trainer? Have you just pissed that man off? Oh, I see. You're playing tower defense. Oh, man, trainer. Oh, you took him all down. And he got a... Oh, ouch. I bet he's going to be annoyed by that. Brilliant endgame. Excellent use of the Baylucine gamut. Is this space chess? <laughs> it's called Kepesh Yakshi, Blade of the Nightwinds. The Asari have played it since we were supposed to meet for lunch. Yes. I'm so sorry. I entered the tournament on a lark. I, I, I thought I'd be eliminated in the first few rounds. I guess you're just oh, too hardcore. Worry. You'll be free to join your friend in 20 moves or fewer. <gasps> <laughs> Trainer, this is would you like to just give me your frigates now? I always take them sooner or later. Don't stand for that, Trainer. Golgara to Sousa. She's knocked me out of four tournaments. Hmm. That was before you helped manage intel for a galactic war. Yeah, you've done that You're right. now. I've gotten a lot better since I came to the Normandy. Darn Which is a frigate, by the way. So try not to lose it. 
Roger that. Roger, Roger. Every time I hear Roger now, I just hear the uh, the battle droids from Clone Wars. Roger, Roger. Uh oh. oh damn it. Ah! So much for your frigate. Neural feedback. It disincentivizes sacrificing pieces casually. I can see that. A few more centuries, trainer, and you might be a challenge. You must not have that much time to practice now living on that warship. Obviously My not. My people have more respect for the great thinkers. I'm able to live quite comfortably teaching Asari Maidens tactics and strategy through this game. Hmm. So, your job is playing games? <laughs> Mentoring students in strategic and tactical simulations. Yes. Specialist trainer here helped us take down Cerberus. We're preparing our final assault thanks to her efforts. Yeah. I'm sure she's a wonderful serviceman. But she just lost her last frigate. Well, I'm sure she can handle something without it. Traded her last frigate, actually, for your homeworld. <gasps> oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Kasuza, you got zapped. Wow, pretty brutal. And I apologize again for missing lunch. Yeah, yeah. All for a good cause, trainer. Carry on. Well, good for you, trainer. You did chess good. Speaking of doing chess good... I think we're trying to find our old buddy. Zaid is supposed to be up here somewhere, but I cannot seem to see him. Here, Zaid. Here, crazy old South African spaceman. There you are, at the claw machine. Naturally. I mean, if there's any You're type mine, of game bastard. I associate with Zaid. Damn it. It's crane Zaid? Game. Over here, Shepard. This thing is fucking impossible. <gasps> Naughty words. What are you doing? There was a kid here, sniveling brat, spending all his credits, crying. <laughs> so you thought you'd get a prize for him? He asked. Looks simple enough. God damn it. And where is the kid? Where's the kid? What do I care? <laughs> Got any credit, Shepard? Isn't there something better we could go to? What could possibly be more important than Zaid Masani not getting bested by some fucking kids game? Oh, you Zaid. really want one of those plushy toys. God I'm right, I do. Okay then. Credits. Sure. But even a bounty hunter's gotta use his manners once in a while. <laughs> Please. <laughs> it took such a long time. You miss. Easy. Easy. They're rigged. I'm sure of it. It's obviously rigged somehow. Rigged? I'm going to hunt down the shit for brains inventor of this crooked game and pull his inspiration out through his asshole. I concur. Probably some smart ass Salarian bastard. Well, I mean, Crane Games have been around. I'm going back in. Credits. Zaid, are you going to manage it? All right. You got it. There you go, sweetheart. Oh, it's a Volus plushie. Okay, Zaid. We're two. How should I know? What do you feel like? Apollos? Casino? More claw? Let's just Zaid, move on. will another victory ever match the one you just experienced? <laughs> You're right. Guess you've been around that block a few times. A few too many. Shepard is Come addicted on, to crane games. Bite. Yes, I am. Little known fact about Commander Shepard. Addicted to crane games. 
All right, and um, <laughs> I love tech armor. It makes no sense, but it's great. Have a good evening, guys. I'm gonna be using it when we come uh, when we come through this so way. But they're sentinel. Wow, Krogan Macbeth, McCrogue. I had this perfect spot. Long sight lines, good cover, no way to get flanked. Such a spot doesn't exist. There are no such spots anywhere in those multiplayer maps. Now let's go home and try to call people on our terminal. I'm sure there's a way to do it. I'm sure of it. You have received a new message. I'll bet I have. Wait, what? From whom? Haven't I heard from everyone already? Oh well. Send invitations. Well, just see if I don't, because I'm going to send all the invitations I can. Alright. Send invitations. Excellent. Invite all available guests to the party. Cortez is invited. Invite Garrus to the house party. Rex Aid. But do I really have to do this? Yeah, sure, I want to invite Zaid. Rex? Yeah, obviously. Aww. I remember that. Obviously, we're going to invite Rex. Tally? Yeah, sure, sure, we'll invite Tally. Samara? If you're still around, why not? I'm not sure what you'll be doing there, but. Yeah, sure, Miranda, you can come, I guess. Kasumi, you're always welcome. Don't mind inviting Kaden. There you go. Uh, Garrus, yeah, obviously. BFF. Oh, and Grunt, sure. You can come to Grunt. But Garrus, obviously, you know, we're going to invite him because he's Garrus. He's our, our BFF, space BFF. And Jack? Yeah, I like Jack. She grew a lot between Mass Effect 2 and Mass Effect 3. And she grew a lot throughout Mass Effect 2, which was pretty nice. Yeah, good to see Jacob. And Javik. Oh, he's the life of the party. Alright, so everyone's invited, right? Everyone's invited. Uh, but, we've got all these messages. So I'm surprised to receive a calm call from council. I'd like to hold what humans call a memorial service. Uh, I'd like to be there as people know what my father understands. Human service people speak well to the dead. Um. Okay. So where is this? Does not matter so much as who attends. So those people in Normandy who are my father. All right. The Normandy's in dry dock. Hit me in the inside the arcade. Steve Cortez, Silverstone Strip. All right. So how do I get people here? Invite up. There we go. Yeah, sure. Let's invite Coliat. We can talk about your dad and how awesome he was and how terrible of a team member he was despite being a badass character. I mean, really, there was no circumstance in which bringing him along, Fane, was We are gathered here useful. to honor the life of Fane Krios. Fane touched each of our lives in different ways. The Counselor knew him as a hero. The Normandy's crew knew him as a brother in arms and others as a father devoted to his son. Well, I mean... Kind of. There's an old human saying. Whoever saves one life, saves the world entire. It's not about a planet, but the value of each of us. I don't know how many times Thane saved my life, or I saved his when we were beyond the Omega-4 relay. It all happened pretty fast. But I do know my whole world could have come to an end then. And it didn't. Even when he was terminally ill and had no business fighting on, something in Thane told him he could save one last life. It was not his own. Thane was too selfless for that. The life he chose was someone's whose decisions could, in fact, save worlds entire. Mm -hmm. It's okay, Joker, you can cry. 
Would anyone else like to speak? What I remember about Thane was his confidence. He told me once about how he remembered everything, even every mistake he made. If I did that, I'd be a nervous wreck. Thane kept it under control. It's strange, but the last word I'd label Thane with is assassin. And we covered each other in firefights. That makes him a partner. Thane's last stand was important. But let us also remember why Thane left the Normandy. To keep his son away from a life of crime. Deeds such as these do not go unnoticed by the universe. They echo in all who hear them. That is why I am here. Thane took himself seriously, a trait with which I did not always agree. I tried to make him laugh on several occasions. But what I interpreted as a lack of humor was masking a great effort. Thane was turning his life around in a way few organics do. Without the truth. The day Thane came onto the Normandy, all Kelly and I knew about him was that he could probably kill us all with a ballpoint pen. But after you got to know him, there wasn't any reason to be afraid. He let you know where you stood. Colyat, do you, uh... uh... Take it away, Raiden. Any time now. When I was little, I thought my father had it all figured out. He said men must be loyal to their friends and dangerous to their enemies. But when he prevented me from, from hurting someone, he had changed. He said enemies and ego are not as important as loved ones. I didn't want to hear it. I was lost. I called him a hypocrite in a thousand different ways, said that he was going soft. Now, I think maybe he did have it all figured out. That's all I can say. If anyone would like to continue, we'll be here. Looks like people are starting to clear out. Commander, thank you for holding this event. In time, it will be a good memory. I don't know if I'll be as philosophical about it. It's still kind of raw. I understand. If you will excuse me, I should take this opportunity to speak with the counselor. Yeah, there's an idea. But what? He is feeling grateful. And I want to point out there are some Solarian biologists who need funding. If anyone would be able to create a breakthrough in the treatment of Keppel's syndrome, it would be them. If you need someone to hold the counselor's feet to a fire, then there. I appreciate the offer, but Counselor Valorant has recently orated about funding science during wartime. My odds are good. Oh, before I go, I was organizing my father's possessions. And I came upon copies of video messages he tried to send you. Oh, dear. I sent them to your extranet address. I hope they help more than they hurt. Until we meet again, Commander. Later, Jack. Uh, so, messages up on the extranet. Let's check those out. Do do do. Do, 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 do. Help, computer. Stop all the downloading. Shepard, I suppose I should thank you for my freedom. Leaving the Normandy was the right decision. It was saddening to see our crew go their separate ways. But it is better than answering questions in an Alliance interrogation room. <laughs> I hope this message finds you well. As for me, I have moved into an apartment on the Citadel not far from Kolyad. I think the first attack I had frightened him. I will spare you the details. It seemed very dramatic at the time. 
But in comparison to the Omega Relay, it was a child's game. Child's game case, still be dangerous. Good luck getting the Alliance to listen to you. Let's keep in touch. Why didn't these go through? Shepard, if you sent a message back, I didn't get it. I suppose communications from someone of my reputation would be restricted. The irony is, I am a danger to no one these days. I am even paying taxes on my investments. Wow. I can't expect Kolyat to do so if I don't. He's <laughs> doing better. He has no significant other, and he is temperamental. But he is employed and staying out of crime. I can tell he's serious about changing. It has cost him more than a few friends. Send something back if you can, Shepard. I can only learn so much from news reports about you. Well, you know, if they're abandoning you when you're trying to change your life, they're not really friends, are they? I have tried a false identity to try to get this message through to you. <laughs> we'll see if it works. I have good news and bad. The good news is that Kolyat and I took a few days to visit Earth. Light the shade of her eyes. Trill sound of chirping stops. I scan the ground. See two tiny bodies locked by claws. Excuse me. As I was saying, we saw a beautiful sunset in New Mexico and a scorpion eating a cricket. I wish you could have joined us. Well, that's quite the bad something. News is, I had. I fainted and struck my head. Kolyat has convinced me to stay at Huerta Memorial on the Citadel. I will be there from now on. I still don't want to die in a hospital. But it's where the doctors are. And Kolyat. I love him. That means I must trust him. Goodbye, Shepard. Let me say that now, in case I cannot later. Mm. Oh, I'll be back. 